Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys have had an amazing, amazing Christmas. It's currently Boxing Day, best time of year, Christmas Day, Boxing Day, New Year's Day, New Year's Eve. I love it. Now today's video is going to be a highly requested one, which is a What I Got For Christmas Haul 2020. Now, I did one of these last year. I'm going to link them down below if you guys are interested to watch. Um, but these are genuinely some of my favourite videos to watch and film. I love watching these. I love seeing what people get. I obviously do want to say a quick disclaimer. I'm not trying to brag. I'm not trying to show off. You guys really wanted to see this video. I had messages from people asking me to do this video. And of course, I think I did a poll about a month or so ago. And a lot of you guys also said you wanted to see it. Hence why I'm going to be doing it. Me and my family, my friends, my boyfriend, we always go very big on Christmas. We spoil each other. I buy presents for them, of course, as well. I just wanted to throw that out there in case anyone watches this video and thinks that I'm being really spoiled or I'm trying to show off what I've got or anything like that you guys really want to see this video I'm really excited to film this video so let's get started so the logical thing would be to start off with what my mum and dad got me first um, so I'm gonna start off with the main presents they got me first and then all the little bits and bobs that they got me to open because they always buy loads of little things so we've got loads to open on Christmas Day it's something we've always always done so my first main present is this Giorgio Armani perfume in C um, now this smells absolutely incredible it's been out for a little while now um, but it's just been one of those perfumes I've wanted to try and I feel like you guys will probably agree with me perfumes are one of those things that you don't ever want to buy yourself um so they're the perfect gift to buy for somebody this is what it looks like it's a 30 ml bottle i've got it on today i had it on all day yesterday for christmas it just smells amazing and i remember my sister having this a few years ago and i was so jealous my next main present was a pair of converse um now these are literally stunning um i was just checking to see if i had any makeup on my hands because i don't want to ruin them they are basically a pair of converse high tops um in white leather like look how like pristine and beautiful these look in the summer these are going to look gorgeous the weather at the minute is horrible i'm literally facing my window and it's raining um and apparently we've got a storm on the way in southwest which is fun um so these won't be coming out for a little while but I'm just so excited. Again, something I've wanted for a really, really long time. So I'm so glad that they picked them up for me. Um, but I just think they look so, so beautiful. You guys know I love Converse. I've literally got about like four pairs of Converse high top now. I was just so, so, so grateful to receive these. And I can't wait to wear them. Next, I got this really, really gorgeous Michael Kors bag. Um, so this is actually a belt bag or like a bum bag, whatever you want to call it. Um, it's basically just got like the classic Michael Kors um, pattern and of course it's got the belt here so you can kind of wear it round well obviously not round here I knew I was getting this this is one of the presents I knew I had the original plan for this was it was going to be ideal for when I go um, on holidays and traveling and stuff obviously because of covid it hasn't happened but me and my boyfriend have planned a lot of holidays um, we were planning to go to Barcelona Amsterdam a lot of cities and I definitely think that having a bum bag or a belt bag is a lot safer um, and I just thought it looked really gorgeous so I was so happy um, I forgot I had this so when I opened it on Christmas day I was literally buzzing and then another main present I got is kind of like it's not a Fitbit but it's like a Fitbit style um, it's called I think I've got the little thing here it's called the new bag and active free um, and it's basically you can track your steps you can track your calories your sleep your heart rate literally everything and obviously it has the time as well I actually did 14,000 steps yesterday I don't know how I managed that um, but already it's motivating me to like get steps in and that's exactly why I love it yeah thank you so much mum and dad for that one I love it and moving on to all the bits that they got me to open there's a lot here I'm gonna have to like whip through these I think because we've got so much more to go through first thing I've got here is a little bag full of like skincare and home stuff first thing I got is this gingerbread cookie reed diffuser which I'm gonna put on as soon as I finish this video because it smells insane. I got an EOS body lotion. Again, I could do with some new body lotions. I always get so much bath and body bits for Christmas. Um, and it's amazing because it means I don't have to buy any for the whole year. So it's ideal. I got this Bayless and Harding Eat and Mess Bath Foam. This sounds insane, I know, and it smells even better, honestly. Oh my god, it smells so good. Eat and Mess is one of my favourite desserts. If you guys don't know what it is, it's like strawberries or raspberries with meringue and cream, and it is Mm, a bliss got me this really funny it's basically like a stress reliever um hot dog um and it's a little sausage dog and there's a little meaning behind this because i love sausage dogs oh my god everything's falling as i was saying i love sausage dogs i really really want one um when i get my own dog whenever i move out in the future um and i just i love them i think they're so cute so yeah they popped one of those in my stocking and 
oh my god can you imagine how soft this is gonna feel i then got this which i was so 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 happy about this is a disney classics coloring book um and it looks so so pretty and it's basically just got loads of coloring pictures of disney characters um you've got like animals on there what's this one like 101 dalmatians disney princesses it's literally incredible it's actually probably one of my favorite gifts i got yesterday um i just love it so so much and i cannot wait to use it i got some fluffy socks i feel like it's not christmas unless you get some form of socks um my mum actually said these are from primark but they feel so soft they're from like a natural um range i think they do i think we got these in bristol but they literally feel so soft and i don't have any soft cozy socks at the minute so i'm so so glad that she got these a couple of little home bits here so she got me this bathe book um which obviously just looks so nice um but i'm also going to read it because it's all about how to relax how to rejuvenate and just feel nice within yourself and have a nice relaxing pamper day so i'm really excited to read this book got me some photo frames which i really really need because i have photos all around my room you guys will see when i do a room tour um which will come within the new year um i have photos everywhere i love it they then got me this massive box full of different chocolates um so the first thing i've got here is a kinder bueno selection box you guys may remember these from some of my bnm hauls how insane i'm so glad that she got this for me she got me a little oreo gift set here oh my god i hit myself in the face we've got cookies we've got chocolate coins what's this down here oh these are some of my favorites these are monty Jangles. she got me a monty Jangles box these are literally insane if you haven't tried them. And festive friends, which are like such a staple. We get these every single Christmas in our stocking. Um, so I love that. It's a hot chocolate bar. They literally filled this up with stuff. My mum then did this really lovely parcel. Um, so she did like a mini hamper. It was all wrapped up with bows and everything. Um, but she basically filled it with Lush bath bombs, which you guys know I love. So she got me the Golden Wonder bath bomb. She got me the Luxury Lush Pud bath bomb. No idea what this one's called, but it's like a little like florally one. I think she got them online she said and she got me my all-time favorite which is the snow fairy bath bomb and i'm so so excited to try these um and they just looked so so cute like i can't oh it was it was lush the next thing i got are these now my mum actually made them um and they're basically little tins that say molly's tea lights and molly's wax melts now you guys know i'm obsessed with wax melts particularly sassy wax i couldn't really wait um so i've already shoved all my wax melts in there this tin that she smells insane how lovely were these i just thought they were such a lovely little thoughtful gift um and they're gonna look so nice on my dressing table i'm gonna put them on my dressing table as soon as this video is finished um but they're just gorgeous and she did such a lovely job and they're such like a I don't know, like a really thoughtful, sentimental gift. Of course, it wouldn't be Christmas without some alcohol. My mum and dad got me a absolute set. So it comes with a shot glass um, and two flavours. It's got the raspberry and vanilla, which are actually two of my favourite vodka flavours and brands in general. I can't wait for these. They're going to be so nice for when we can finally go out drinking again and stuff. May even have a cheeky one today because, you know, it's Christmas. And then they also got me this, which I have already dipped into, um, but it is this Cadbury's festive cake selection box. I didn't even know they did these. Um, but it basically comes with loads of Cadbury's cakes in a selection box. Um, and you guys can see, like, I've eaten... I think I've had, like, four of these already. But, oh, they amazing. And literally, I was so excited when I opened this. They also got me two mugs. Um, I actually got a lot of mugs for Christmas. So the first one I got is this Lady in the Tramp one, which is literally gorgeous. I love Disney. You guys know and Lady in the Tramp is one of my favourites from when I was little. So they got me this mug. And then they also got me this really Christmassy one, which says Merry and Bright. Um, and I'm going to make a little hot chocolate with this later, I think. It just looks so, so nice and Christmassy. My mum also put together this really lovely little gift box. Um, and it was just filled with stuff. Another Reed diffuser. This one is in Vanilla Crush. Um, she got me some makeup. So she got me this Revolution by Soph eyeshadow palette. One of the Friends Monica palettes, which i love i haven't tried it yet but it looks so good she got me this monica lip gloss as well i've actually got it on today i love it it kind of reminds me of the fenty beauty ones so so nice like really lovely face mask set here got me three revolution lipsticks another wax burner like simple stuff chocolate like she literally filled this to the brim and it was just so nice she used really lovely like glittery tissue paper it just looked lovely it was such a lovely little gift to open so thanks mum for putting that together and then the final thing that my mum and dad got me um is this soap and glory set so it's a massive tin it's wrapped in like a little parcel um and it literally comes with so so much there's a dry shampoo 
Um, there's a shower gel, a hand cream, moisturiser, there's a scrub, what's this, like face mask here. They're all full size products and every single year me and my sister will get a Saving Glory set. And I feel like it's not Christmas if I don't have one now because we li it's like a tradition, I swear. Now, although I said that was the final thing from my mum and dad, my dad actually did pick out a separate gift um, for me and my sister just from him. Um, obviously my parents are together, but my dad wanted to do something just for us this year. Um, and he got me something that I've been really, really needing and really does mean a lot. So he basically got me um, a little adapter for my MacBook. Now because my MacBook's brand new, it doesn't have all of the adapters that a normal one would and you actually have to buy them separately. So my dad has bought me one of the adapters um, that you can literally put an SD card in, um, you can charge your phone, also got me a little charging cable to go with it. Um, now Obviously, you guys won't know the full story, but this is such a thoughtful gift. Basically, whenever I have to edit YouTube videos, I have to go up to our, like, summer house cabin that we have in our garden, where our Mac stays, um, and I have to go up there and I have to um, basically airdrop all of my footage onto there and then airdrop it onto my laptop. And the process takes so long. Our Mac's quite old now, so it does take a long time. This is literally going to save me so much time because it means I can literally upload the footage directly to my MacBook. Um, so I just want to say a massive thank you to my dad for getting these because they were expensive, they're definitely not cheap and they're going to just help me out so, so much. Okay, next I'm going to go with what my boyfriend and my boyfriend's family got me. So my boyfriend was really cute. He basically put together this massive box full of stuff for me, wrapped it all up so it was like a massive like lucky dip thing. It was so fun. So my main present from my boyfriend is actually to go and see a musical he's taking me to go and watch Beauty and the Beast at Bristol Hippodrome. Um, Beauty and the Beast is one of my all-time favourite Disney films. I actually did the musical at school and I played Mrs Potts, so um, it's got a lot of sentimental value to that as well. It is for next September when it comes on tour um, and we're going to go out for some nice dinner as well, so that should be really, really fun. So I was so, so excited. I'll have to like insert a picture of um, the production. And then he got me lots of bits, so he got me two books because I love reading, um, so he got me the um, Margaret Atwood The Testaments book and then he got me the Blood Orange book. Um, both of these I've been wanting to read for the longest time and I just haven't so I'm so glad I've got these to read. Some bath bombs, so in here is a little lush one um, which is like Angel Delight I think, it literally smells so so good and then he got me this massive giant one as well. Another thing he got me I was so excited about is some wax, um, this is Sassy Wax again you guys know I love, um, and it's a duo tub, now these are actually really expensive, they come to about £30 for these usually, and he got me the duo set in hot chocolate and cookies and cream, but they literally look gorgeous, he got me some Jaffa cakes, because I love Jaffa cakes, he knows that, um, he got me some love heart shower gel, he got me a, what's this one, sweet berries and honey blossom candle, he got me loads of alcohol as well, but I did drink it yesterday on Christmas day, he got me hooch, he got me chocolate, again that's already been eaten some like galaxy we've also dipped into this but he also filled up this massive sweet jar as well and it's got chocolate buttons it's got squashies it's got haribos it's got tantastics it's got all my favorite sweets in there um and again it's so thoughtful he is honestly the most thoughtful person when it comes to gifts and he just really really thinks about what i want he's really good like that so a massive thank you reese for all my presents you've done so so well again this year he always does anyway but you've definitely put a big big smile on my face and i can't wait for beauty and the beast then from my boyfriend's family they they also really support me as well. Um, so from his mum and dad, the first thing I got is this little Lush gift set, um, which is the Snow Fairy one. I've got a lot of Lush this year. It comes with the Snow Fairy bath bomb and mini shower gel. And then they also got me this, which I was so, so grateful for. It is a MAC eyeshadow palette, um, and it is in Mischief Minx. It's like a really lovely little leopard print um, and it just comes with some super, super gorgeous eyeshadows. So I was so grateful for that. So thank you both for that. And my boyfriend's brother and his fiance got me a little something. So they also got me a Lush bath bomb um, and then they got me a Lint Lindor box of chocolates. Um, one of my all time favorite chocolates ever. So I'm dipping into these in a minute. Next I'm going to move on to what my sister got me. Again, my sister really sport me. We do go all out for each other but she definitely, definitely sport me this year. So she basically put all my presents in this really lovely little Christmassy box. First thing she got me is a Tangle Teaser. I've literally been wanting a Tangle Teaser for the longest time so I was so excited to get this. It got me the Disney collaboration with Makeup Revolution makeup bits. So she got me the Princess and the Frog eyeshadow palette. 
the Cinderella highlighter and then the Beauty and the Beast lip topper and I'm so excited to try these. I've wanted to try them for so long. I might even do like a video on them, maybe testing them out. She then got me a Kiehl's face cream. This is the Ultra Face Cream but it's like the Christmassy edition. Again, I've been really wanting to try this for a long time. I've got it on today and it literally has made my skin so soft. She then got me a Benefit Mini Roller Liner. It's a brown liner. Again, I have it on today and I've been wanting to use brown liquid liner for so, so long. I have dark hair and I have quite dark eyes um, and I think that brown liner really complements it. So I, I'm in love with this and thank you so, so much. She then got me these brushes. They are Skinny Dip collaboration with Barbie and how gorgeous are these? They are the most beautiful little brushes and I literally can't wait to give them a go. My sister also did me a little stocking. We both did one for one another. Another. She got me some lashes, she got me some W7 set spray, loads of like face masks here, um, we've got more little makeup y bits, more face masks, the gorgeous little um, donut bath bomb which I'm obsessed with. My best friend Chloe, she got me a really lovely little gift set of stuff. She got me two books. Um, the first one is Midwife Murders. I've never read this, but it sounds amazing. And then she also got me The Family Upstairs, which is a book that I know she's read. She told me it's incredible. So thank you so much for these. Then it got me some wax melts. She got me some little makeup y bits. And then this really lovely Christmassy mug that I've been seeing all over YouTube and Instagram at the minute. Um, it's a little gingerbread house. And then she's also filled it with loads of Options Hot Chocolate, which is my favorite. My sister's boyfriend also then got me something really lovely. So he got me a dairy milk box um, which again is chocolate you guys know me that's gonna go to good use and then he also got me a H&M gift card um, which again I'm really really excited to use I love shopping in H&M you guys know that there will be a haul pending from my mum's best friend and my godmother um, Mandy she got me some really really lovely bits as well she gave me some money um, which I'm so grateful for I'll obviously do some shopping um, she then got me a little Lindor reindeer got me some um, friends uh, bath fizzes and then she also got me these I'm so 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 excited for these these guess a little makeup travel bags they literally look gorgeous um, and these are literally perfect I needed some new makeup bags and travel bags so these are gonna be ideal my mum's other friend Kelly also got me a gift card she got me a 20 pound gift card for the multi-store one so you can shop in Primark boots H&M River Island Foot Locker like there's literally loads on that and then finally I've got my nan and my my uncle and my auntie who also both got me money um, so I want to say a massive thank you for that as well you guys have really really spoiled me so I hope you guys enjoyed this video as you can see I got a lot a lot of stuff and Honestly, I'm, I can't even put into words how grateful I am. Everyone outdoes themselves every single year and you've made me one happy girl. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really hope that you had a lovely Christmas, you had a lovely day. If you don't celebrate it, you did something fun. Um, obviously within the circumstances, it's been a really rubbish year, but Christmas was such a lovely day um, just to kind of forget about it and just enjoy ourselves. And I really, really hope you guys had a lovely day. Remember to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it course please do leave a comment down below letting me know your thoughts and I will see you all very very soon for another video. Bye!